So guys, a company named Polar Pro, they sent me this awesome accessory for the Mavic. Basically all it does is just clip on to the Mavic, you take off the propellers, and now you have a handheld gimbal. And before we get started guys, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I make new videos all the time. Drone videos, smartphone videos, tech videos, everything in between. So how it works, all you do is just switch the Mavic to Wi-Fi mode, take off all the propellers for your safety, connect it to the app, start recording, and then you're good to go. So basically the Mavic is just recording without being in the air. You walk around. The quality of your footage is gonna be super dependent on how steady you are, the environment you're walking in, stuff like that. So you're gonna to have to practice quite a bit to get the best shot. But why I really like this is that if you record with the Mavic like this and also fly the Mavic in the air, you can get very similar shots. A lot of vloggers will use like a handheld camera like the Canon 80D, shoot with the Mavic, and then combine it to one vlog. The footage isn't gonna look very similar because two different sensors, two different cameras, two different processors. So it's pretty cool to get like ground shots and sky shots with the same exact sensor. Now obviously like it wouldn't make much sense to vlog with one, <laughs> but um, it is pretty cool. And I like that it's dual purpose. Yeah, you could buy the Osmo to get some handheld vlogging, um, smooth action, but this little accessory is pretty affordable. You just pop it right on. You can even get some ND filters from Polar Pro, pop those on as well, and you're gonna get some really good footage. They actually sent me some of the cinema grade ND filters that I'm testing out right now. Don't wanna chime in on them too much quite yet, but the quality is amazing. They also offer us polarized and ND versions. So if you're interested in any of those, I'll put links in the description below. Links to the ND filter and links to this is below. One thing to keep in mind that made me a little upset, I don't know if upset's the word to use, but I'm one that doesn't really read instructions or pay attention to important steps. So when you put this on, you then have to connect to Wi-Fi. The thing is the Wi-Fi login credentials for the Mavic are underneath the wings or underneath the battery door. So you have to make sure you connect before you put this on or you'll find yourself like me kind of aggravated that you put it all on and now you're trying to connect to the Wi-Fi of the Mavic. So the order that you want to install everything, first you want to connect to the Wi-Fi, then you want to attach this piece on top and then you want to make sure it's oriented facing you before you attach it to the Mavic. Those three steps, if you have those in mind, every time you do this will be so much faster. And that's really it guys. Hopefully you enjoyed my footage that I displayed to you as I was talking about this. Mavic does really get great footage considering how small it is. It's basically like a Galaxy S7 or S8 on a gimbal, in the sky, on the ground, everything in between. So it's pretty nifty. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Are you gonna pick up something like this? I really like it. So guys, I hope you have a great day. Have a good weekend. Bye.